I believe it's a red card, but again, this is where we get shot down for going back to other incidents. Mm -hmm. uh, Greg Taylor's tackle on Blair Spittle last week is, is no different. Um, he receives a yellow card. Harry Payton rightly gets a red card, um, so I think that that probably tells you where, where I sit. Same as every other manager, we can all compare decisions, and what I would just love us to do is, is not me for me to keep coming out here on a Saturday evening and saying the same thing over and over again. These types of tackles must come with the same punishment, but for some reason, for whatever reason, it certainly doesn't. You know, you speak to people at Celtic Park last week, members of staff and people that know that Greg Taylor's got away with one last week, whether it's a yellow card or not a red, and then we come here and forgive me for thinking that we are going to get punished for it, and rightfully so, I accept that, I accept that, but it does change the dynamics of games, it does change the scenario of games, um, and just now I feel like we, we get punished for absolutely everything, I've seen something during the week, our card counts higher than everybody else's, because every cynical foul in the middle of the park for me goes with a yellow card, again fine if that goes both ways, those momentum changes I talk about, but I don't feel that's going that way at this minute in time, and it really frustrates me, I spoke to Crawford on a number of occasions about certain aspects that are frustrating me, but we need to join it up, you know, it's fine and well having these conversations, but when it comes to crunch on a Saturday, we have to make sure um, that we're starting to get these decisions right and, uh, you know, because those those will be aspects that will help us in a, in a kind of quest to go and see if we can amass more points, there's no doubt about that.